Hey guys, so real quick, we're gonna find the least common multiple of these two polynomials. And the way you do that is you factor them both first. So the way we factor this guy out, we need two numbers that multiply to give us 30 and add to give us 11. And that's six and five. So we're gonna make a little box. And this two x squared gets rewritten this 15 gets rewritten, but we're gonna break this 11x up according to what we found here. So it's gonna be 6x and 5x. Now we just find out what we would multiply by to get these inside. 2x times x gives us 2x squared, and then 2x times what? 3 gives us 6x, and x times what? 5 gives us 5x. So now this one factored is 2x plus 5, times x plus three. Now for this one, first thing I see is a common term, so we're gonna pull an x out first. So that gives us x squared plus eight x plus 15. And then we're going to do the same thing. We want two numbers that multiply to 15 and add to eight. In this case, five and three. So we have x plus five and x plus three and then an x. And I didn't bother doing all this stuff because I usually only do that when this is more than one. In this case, it was just a one leading coefficient, so it was a lot easier. And now we just need to find out what do these have in common. So the x, we need at least one x for our LCM. We'll need an x plus five. We'll need an x plus three. And a two x plus five. And then we don't need to list another x plus three because that's already taken into account here. So this right here is our LCM. Hope that makes sense. Talk to you guys later. Bye.